Ah, finally, I can Jesus. relax. This place smells like old sausage. She cannot be trusted. Who? Skylar? I won't argue with that. I never understood what you see in her. Look, Skylar and I... Well, it's complicated. Is this really what you wanted to talk about? No, of course not. Our friend Ryman has been listening in on German wire traffic. He tells me the whole city is buzzing about some scientist who went missing after some train accident. You don't say? It's time you told me what you've gotten yourself into. It's safer if you don't know. Do you not trust me? I, and I need you to trust me. How goes the revolution? We've got something special coming up. Something big. Might as well tell me now. You Frenchies never could keep a secret. Not yet. Soon. First, we gather our strength. I need to meet some friends of ours south of the river. We're going to need transit papers. And you want me to pay a visit to the Spaniard? <laughs> you have a business arrangement, no? Aye. But I can't say I trust the bastard. Go see Santos, my friend. Find me once you have the papers. Hidden right under their noses. It makes me laugh. Do something so I can eat. Take this. Right. Thanks. A man by the name of Horst is organizing an underground street race in the city. I thought you might be interested. Sky. <laughs> you have been busy, Irishman. I hear many things. You should be more careful. For a man in your line of work, a reputation can be dangerous. The same can be said of black marketeers who do business on both sides of the pitch. I am a capitalist. I don't give a pig's arse what you call yourself. I need transit papers to operate south of the river. I see. And what business brings you to that part of our lovely city? No business of yours. You know how it works, Irishman. You do a favor for me, I do a favor for you. Name your price then. Excellent! I've got your new papers right here. Be careful down there, Irishman. 
You are headed for the most dangerous part of our beautiful city. Didn't I? Ah, finally, I can relax. Tomorrow I'm going to scrub away this old blood. I got the transit papers. Now why don't you tell me what this is about? We are going to meet a man called Duval Mingo. He is no patriot, but he hates the Nazis, and he commands the loyalty of the rebels south of the River Seine. What's so important that you'd risk bringing together every rebel leader in the city? I won't discuss it here. For now, I can only say that you play a key role in our plans, Sean. I don't like being kept in the dark, Luke. Then come with me. We will go meet this man Mingo, then we will discuss what comes next. Where are we headed? The Latin Quarter. We will rendezvous with Mingo at the Jardin du Plant. Move it! So, it seems I am not the only one getting into bed with the British Empire. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> the lovely Lady Sinclair is one dirty minx, eh? Veronique tells me the two of you are old friends. Veronique has a weakness for idle gossip. I am told English women are cold on the outside, but warm on the inside, no? I thought you were meant to be a classy bloke. Why don't we take Skylar and Veronique up to La Havre this weekend for a little wine tasting? Isn't there still a war on? All the more reason for some joie de vivre while we still can, huh? I won't argue with that. Now we'll find out if Santos earned his fee. Keep your eyes open. Something does not feel right. Keep walking. 
in your highness. These streets can be dangerous after dark. Are you the one called Mingo? Who is asking? Luke Godin. Ah, the big man himself. <laughs> Come down from the penthouse to do a little slumming. Hmm? This isn't a social call. I have business to discuss. Business requires trust. Trust must be earned. Ah, that sword cuts both ways. It is dangerous to meet in the open like this. You risk too much. What's that? Germans! It's a fucking ambush. Take cover! Back in the fucking car! know we'd be here. There must be a leak somewhere. But don't look at me. This meeting was your idea. Shut your traps, both of you. We're not out of this mess yet. The foursome in La Havre. I'm sure Veronique would be delighted to have you and Skyler join us. Don't count on it. Oh, something I should know. Looks like we're almost there. Thank God. What is your name, Irishman? Devlin. Well, Mr. Devlin, you're a resourceful man. Stick around after the meeting. I may have some work for you. Appreciate it, mate. I heard Hitler's mistress was the train's passenger. A trap for a great war survivor. Watch it, fella.
Ah, there's Sean. Let's get started. By now, most of you have seen these posted around the city. Our German overseers have devised a grand spectacle to convince us of their Aryan superiority. A race to be held here in Paris and broadcast to every corner of occupied Europe. Several high-ranking Nazi officials will be in attendance, including General Eckhart. My comrades, this is the moment we have waited for. We will seize this opportunity to strike a blow that will shake the very foundations of the Third Reich. The crowd brass will be heavily guarded. You'll never get close to them. You're right, Sean. We can't get close, but you can. What the fuck are you talking about? After the race, there will be an awards ceremony at the base of the Eiffel Tower. During this ceremony, General Eckhart will present the winning driver with an iron cross. That is when we will strike. How are you gonna get past the security? I won't have to, Sean. You are going to win the race. I don't even have a proper car. How am I supposed to win a race? Speak to Vittore. He has some good news to share with you. And Sean, you may be interested to know that the Germans are placing bets on the winning driver. At last count, the odds were five to one in favor of Kurt Dierker. This place is a little creepy. Dr. Felix Kwong, at your service. I have heard much about you. I hope that we can work together. That depends on what sort of work you have in mind, Mr. Kwong. Dr. Kwong, I am a clinical psychiatrist. Do you know what that means? I don't know. You like to dress up in women's clothes? <laughs> that is very amusing. I'm sure your sense of humor serves you well in situations where you feel threatened or insecure. There's no much threatening about a bloke wearing a dress, Doctor. Never mind. Did you have a proposal to make? Despite what you might think, Mr. Devlin, I am a soldier. My battlefield is the human mind. My objective is to destroy the enemy's will to fight. There's a new field called psychological warfare. There's nothing new about it, Doctor. We Irish have been at it for centuries, on both sides of the pitch. Then. You understand why we must begin by sowing the seeds of fear and mistrust among our enemies. Our tool will be a traitor. In this case, a man who doesn't even know that he is a traitor. You got a crowd to turn coat. How? A combination of experimental drugs and hypnosis. I won't bore you with the details. Suffice to say, this Nazi will carry out my instructions. And what are those instructions? to assassinate a notorious Gestapo commander called Bauer. All you need to do is drive our impressionable German friend to Bauer's headquarters and make sure he completes his assignment. Now I'm playing chauffeur for a Nazi? Must be a chilly day in hell. Good day to you, Doctor. I'll let you know how your little scheme works out. Destroyed a passenger train filled with innocent people. Lovely piece, this one. I just bought this car. So, 
What's it like being a Nazi and all? My name is Corporal Spitz. I have a package for Herr Bauer. Oh. What's in the package? Whiskey, sausages, porno magazine. Christ, that's one hell of a gift basket. Where can I get one? I am Corporal Spitz. I have a package for Herr Bauer. Yeah, I gathered that. You just sit tight, Spitzy. Bauer's place is just up the road a bit. This is the place. You go on ahead. I'll be waiting here when you get back. Halt! Zutritt verboten! Alter Offizier speaks. Ich habe ein Paket für Hein Bauer. Bitte lassen Sie mich durch. Zu welcher Einheit gehören Sie? Woher kommt dieses Paket? Alter Offizier speaks. Ich habe ein Paket für Hein Bauer. Das stimmt was nicht. Nehmen Sie diesen Mann fest und öffnen. Scheit! Fuck it up! One scheme just went pear shaped. I'll have to finish up Bauer myself. Einfach rüberfahren! 